Tennessee, and of course, Algebra 1, practice test question number 32. The table shows the number of tickets remaining in the first six rows of a theater for an upcoming concert. On the day of the concert, the number of remaining tickets in row A decreases by one. So it goes down one to make a new two. I'm going to write this set over here. While the number of remaining tickets in row F decreases by three, so five minus three also gives you two. What is the effect of these changes on the mode? Now, anything that didn't change, I just need to rewrite. One, two, A, B, C, D, E, F, A, B, C, D, E, F. Row A decreases by one, number of row tickets in row F decreases by three. So both of those are represented. This is my original set, and this is my new set. Now I need to see how much it changes things. Now if you know what mode is, it's the most. So in this case, the one that happens the most, I have one, two, fours. So it is four. That's the mode of my star set. Over here, my mode becomes two, because now I have three twos. That's the new mode. And that means it decreases by two, so it is this. However, if that's a little bit weird to see, or if you forget what mode is, you could always just make lists. So go into your list, however you do that. In my calculator, I hit list, but I think if you have a TI-84, it's like second list. So I'm going to type in the terms in the original set. Three, two, four, four, six, and five. In L2, which would be the second set, I'm going to type in that set, 2, 2, 4, 4, 6, 2. Now, for me, in order to analyze these, I have to quit out of the uh, list, and then I'm going to hit second, and for me, stat, or second list. I'm going to go over to do math. This question only asks about mode, which makes it really convenient. Mode of the first group, which is L1, is 4. If I want to go in, hit second list, go over to mode, and look at L2, that would be 2. So I have to see how it changes. So it decreases, it goes down, and it goes down by 2. So the answer to number 32 on this practice test is F.